In this video, we'll go through exam questions that cover the criteria, recognize and interpret the symbols add, subtract and equals appropriately. You can locate the questions on the MassMath.com website under Entry 1. The questions come from different exam boards. We'll start with non-calculator questions and then we'll move to the calculator questions. Here is the first question. Lila gives change to customer. She wants to work out 20, take away 11. We know the symbol for take away is minus, it's this one. How can Lila work out 20, take away 11? So 20, take away 11. That is this option here. The first one is 20 add 11, which isn't what we need. The third option is 11 take away 20, so the other way around, and that doesn't work with subtraction. 11 add 20, again, that's not what we need. So the one that we've ticked is the only correct option. Alex has 12 stickers for the badges. He uses 8 stickers. How does Alex work out how many stickers he has left over? Left over, that's a word that we see with subtraction. So 12 he had in total and then he uses 8. So take away 8 should give us what is left. Where is that option here? That is option D. A, B and C are incorrect options. Rosie and her mum buy a blazer and a tie. Blazer £15, tie £4. How do they work out the total price? Tick your answer. So they've bought two items. One of them costs £15 and the other four. To work out the total, we're adding, so 15 at 4. That is option A. Option B is 15 take away 4, which you don't really use when you want the total of two items. 4 take away 15, that's the reverse of this. Again, that's subtraction. And then we have 15 equals 4, which isn't true but also not what we need. So option A is the only correct one. Nine, missing symbol, seven equals 16. So we've got to write the correct symbol to finish the calculation. So we've got add, subtract or equal. Which one? 9 add 7, that gives us 16. That is correct. So the missing symbol is the add or addition symbol. Now we've got 15, missing symbol 7 equals 8. So this number is bigger then we take away 7 to give us 8 because 8 add 7 equals 15. So write the correct symbol to finish the calculation and that was the minus or subtraction symbol. How can you work out 11 take away 8? So 11 take away 8. Where is that? That's this one here. The rest of the options are not correct. Now we can use a calculator from now on. Rita needs to add 10 and 5. So add. How can Rita add 10 and 5? 10 add 5. Where is that? That's this one here. 
Liz buys a return ticket for £2. She pays with a £20 note. Liz works out her change. Put the missing symbol in the boxes. So, to work out change, we subtract. We've got the total, which is 20. And we take away the cost, which in this case is £2. So, 20 take away 2 equals 18. There are seven bottles on a shelf. Evie puts 13 more bottles on the shelf. So more means adding. She works out the total number of bottles on the shelf. Put the missing symbol in the box. So 7 add 13 equals 20. Always, if you used already addition or subtraction, then the next symbol will be equals. Fez adds his scores, so he's probably playing. What is the symbol for add? That's the symbol for add or addition. Dylan brushes five horses in the morning. He brushes four horses in the afternoon. How does Dylan work out the total number of horses he brushes? So total, that is adding the morning ones as well as the afternoon ones. Tick your answer. So we've got five and the four. Where is that? That's option C. The rest of the options are not correct. And this is the end of the questions.